In this quick tune track tutorial, I'm going to show you how to get a parallel compression sound very quickly within Superior Drummer 3. Parallel compression simply means you have a dry signal for your drum track and you have a compressed signal and you're mixing both together to create a parallel signal both dry and compressed. We're going to simulate that here in Superior Drummer 3. I have a Premiere Kit loaded. using the Noble and Cooley snare. This is within Superior Drummer 3 chord library. And I'm gonna to go to the mixer. We're just gonna to go to the main output bus where everything is routed to. I'm going to go to dynamics and add the Comp 76. This is an FET style vintage compressor. Now, even just by adding this compressor, let's listen to the change in the sound. Already a little bit more presence in the default state, and we hear a bit more of the room. Now what we're going to do is use this parallel pump preset. That's gonna give us more compression. We have faster attack and release, 20 to one ratio. So more compression, yet we're dialing back the mix. That's where we're going to get that dry and compressed sound at the same time. Let's take a listen. Now we can dial the mix in anywhere we want. We can back it off if we want. Or you can see we can get very aggressive, turn the mix up more than the preset, which was at 45%, or turn it up all the way for a really compressed sound. So there we're taking all of the compressed signal, not mixing it in with any dry, uncompressed signal. And that's how you can quickly get a parallel compression drum mix and drum sound within Superior Drummer 3 using the Comp 76 compressor on the main output of your drums along with the parallel pump preset.